Hey y'all, uh, I don't know what happened. It just closed it just closed out itself. That was strange. Look up to the light. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hell no. Hold on. Oh no. Oh no, not that shit. Controls. There we go. Oh, I about to say, hell no. That's that to me personally, that's a weird controller. Uh like if you if you go up, you go down, you go down and go up. I hate that controller. I had to go to the lighthouse. I knew there was something important waiting for me there. You don't even recognize me, do you, Ryder? You think you're God? You think you can just make up stuff? Play with people's lives and kill them when you think it adds to the drama? You're in this story now, and I'll make you suffer. You're a joke. There would be a single readable sentence in your books if it wasn't for your editor. You'll never publish another one of your shitty stories. Because I'm gonna kill you. It's not like your stories are any good. Not like they... You missed your deadline! You can't die. Damn. You can't stop me! So why I heard about this game? Oh, fuck. I realized that the hitchhiker was a character from the story I'd been working on. How does it feel to die by the hands of your own creation? Hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. Goddamn. They got a stab or Well done. 
I have something important to tell you. It goes like this. For he did not know that beyond the lake he called home lies a deeper, darker ocean green, where waves are both wilder and more serene. To its ports I've been. To its ports I've been. Do you understand? No. Follow my light. Hell, I almost have my damn self. Well, I'll tell you something, this, this, these companies make some weird ass story. The darkness is dangerous. It's sleeping now. When it feels you coming, it will wake up. There's no time. I can only show you the most important thing. The hitchhiker has been taken over by the dark presence. You can't hurt him now. The darkness protects him from all harm. Only light can drive the darkness away and make him vulnerable again. Here, take the light. Flashlight toward him and burn the darkness away. You did it. Now the darkness no longer protects him, but it's still inside, controlling him. He can't be saved. He's still a threat. He is still your enemy. Here, take the gun. Taught you. That is all. I will give you back your dream now. In the nightmare, a terrible darkness was taking over the world. The lighthouse was the last safe place on Earth. I saw that. That was. That was strange. Tap it real fast. Oh, that this is it, watch! God damn it. Dog in my butt. Baby, just another nightmare. Everything's fine. You dozed off. So the good right. question is... Anything more than dozed off would be news for everyone. The good question Cheer is... Up, handsome. We're here. The thing he write... 
I, I know I know this era in the game, but I'm kind of curious with the story. But the thing he's right come real. Like, I think I heard bits of parts of this game a long time ago. Oh, um, I don't know. <clears throat> I'm kind of curious. next to that old gentleman there. I want a shot of you with the town in the background. <laughs> sure. I'll even give you a title for the shot. A city boy. Moments before he got eaten by a bear. Hi. Hello there. You picked a good time to visit our town. Deerfest is just two weeks away. Deerfest, huh? Did you hear that, honey? Yeah, nice you car, have though. a lovely wife. Uh, if you don't mind me saying it. I'm happy, but nice to meet you. Yeah, I'm Alan Wake. I won't pretend I don't recognize a famous writer such as yourself, Mr. Wake. A pleasure. I'm an avid reader. Oh, okay, I, okay, I did say right. isn't too presumptuous of Your damn name is Alan Wake. I'm the night host of the local radio station. Any chance I could get an interview? Look, Mr. Maine, I'm on vacation. In fact, I'd appreciate it if we could keep my being here just between the two of us. I'm sure you understand. Fair enough. You can trust me to be useful. Not a hard man to track down if you change your mind, though. I hope you two have a lovely yeah, I'm trying to tell you. That's it, right? Man, shit. Taking pictures. Very right. nice. I got a couple of really good ones. And I see you made a friend. That's cute. Right. <clears throat> Yeah. Hey, bestseller. That was my favorite writer. Are you there yet? Barry. Yeah. We just got here. Are the locals giving you trouble? Just say the word, and I'll hop on a plane and come make sure that you're left alone, Al. No, Barry. We're fine. Great. Great. Just want to make sure you can relax and recharge. So, how is the place? Has it gotten your creative juices flowing? Barry. We're just settling in. Okay, Al. I'll call back later to make sure you're doing okay. And you call me if there's a problem, okay? Okay. Just looking out for you, buddy. Talk to you later. I love you too, Barry. You know he's going to be calling you every five minutes. Barry is Barry. I can always turn off the phone. What did I tell you? Text message from Barry. He says hi to you too. I can't stand there. Alan, we're here. Come on, let's get back to the car. Let's go. We need to stop at the local diner to get the cabin key from the landlord. A Mr. Carl Stuckey. I don't know why that model, that, that vehicle model to me is like a uh, Chevy. <laughs> I'll lift her up you get the key. I'll it's like a Chevy to me. 15 minutes. Sure. Alan. Thank you for coming here with me. I love you too. Go on. I'll promise to behave. I'd forgotten there were still places like this. Towns where everybody knew everybody. Welcome to the Oh Dear Diner. Hi, I was wondering if you could help me. I'm looking for... Mr. Wake. Alan, wake up. <gasps> I am your biggest fan. I know people say that all the time, but I really am. I'm glad to hear that. Rose. Rose, I'm looking for Mr. Stuckey. Carl Stuckey? Carl? Oh, of course, Mr. Wake. He must have gone to visit the restroom. He'll be back in a moment. I can't believe it. I've got all of your books. I got the cutout from the bookstore when they took it out of the window. <laughs> and you keep it here. Well, okay. Good for you. Damn, blocked the whole damn way. Try the coffee. Do me a favor, Sonny. I could really use a tune right now. Coconut, number six in the jukebox. I'd do it myself, but both of my legs have gone to sleep. Coffee? Bad circulation. Yeah. Are you serious? Coconut again? 
You disgust me. Yeah. Call yourself Don't a... go in there, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. I think I can handle it, ma'am. I didn't want to wait. I wanted to find Stucky, to get the key and get out as soon as possible. The waitress was giving me a headache. Over eager. Hello? Mr. Stucky? Well, I don't know if it's his. I gotta, I gotta keep fine now. Carl couldn't make it. Unfortunately, he was taken ill. I got the, I got the But I have the key on. for you and instructions on how to I am so delay. curious about this damn store. Okay. I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. And to meet your wife. I insist. Thanks. Cauldron Lake is a special place. Very inspiring. Y'all yeah, see. Just came out the damn cut. You got lucky this time, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. <laughs> this would... Even that sounds better than your singing. Are you all right? <laughs> the Andersons, they're, uh, local musicians. We're waiting for Dr. Hartman to come pick them up. They wandered off from his clinic at the Cauldron Lake lot. Bye, Mr. Wake. Mission accomplished. The key and the directions. My hero. I got some flashlights, just in case. Hey, wait! Mrs. Wake! Your... Your keys! That diner was a real nut house. <laughs> got the wrong key? I'm going to the wrong camera. Can you believe this place? This would make a wonderful setting for a book. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. I'll figure it out when we get back home. Okay? Okay. We can talk about this later. Bad man here on KBF FM. I didn't want to talk about it. I wanted to bury my head in sand. Here's another one of my favorites to go with it. Once upon a time, I was a successful writer, but that was a long time ago. I hadn't been able to write a word in two years, not since my last book. And now the weather. It's going to be a clear night, so you folks in the big city might want to look up every once in a while and see those stars winking down at you. It gets pretty dark out here, but they'll light your way. Two. Wow. It's gorgeous, Alan. It's something, all right. Don't worry, honey. I'll get you inside safe and sound before it gets dark. And I've got the flashlight. I know. I Alice had a phobia. The fear of darkness. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. Oh. It's dark in there. We need lights. Can you figure out how to get the power on, honey? Hello? Okay. Anyone here? So that's how you drain them. Okay. Uh, lights, lights. What are lights at? I don't know. What the hell is that for? I'm gonna go upstairs. For a moment, the oppressive feel of the nightmare I had seen on the ferry returned. Ooh, Damn. What the fuck was that? I needed to get the power running in the cabin. There had to be a fuse box or a generator somewhere on the island. I think it's outside, man. The cabin looked like a time capsule from the 60s. Or even earlier. Oh, what the hell was that though? So the general must be outside. 
The Deerfest guests have already started to arrive. Just ran into one on the ferry. Famous artist, no less. We'll see if we can rope them into an interview later on. Now let's uh, go to the phone. Uh, it won't be here. Hi, Pat. It's Rose. Why, hello, Rose. What's on your mind? I know who that famous artist was. It was Alice Lee. The power cable goes to that shed over there. An old generator had been connected to the power cable. Oh, I don't figure. The lights are on. Good work, honey. I'll freshen up a bit and start settling in. Okay. I'll look around a bit. Sure thing. Have the fun. island had once been the site for a love story. It was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. I mean, it's good so far. I don't I care about the story, happy though. Here. Maybe it would be that again. Honey? Close that down door. I got a little stairs. Alan, I'm upstairs. I have a surprise for you. Well, hello there. I'm not the surprise. It's in the study. Go take a look. <laughs> okay. Surprise! Alice? What is this? I guess I have a small confession to make. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past- Damn, Alice, you- everyone Hey, keeps... hey, hey, just hear me out! There's a local doctor, Dr. Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. Maybe... So now you want to get me committed? No! It's not like that! That's not- Alan? Alan? I don't! Just don't! I don't want to hear it! God damn it, Alice! God damn it! I knew she wouldn't follow me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. Oh. <sighs> Wait, he got some powers like he could, like he control his his stories. Damn it! <sighs> Alice. Alice? Alice, no! No! Alice! The cabin had gone dark. All the lights were out. Alice! Alice! Where are you? Help! Alice! I'm coming! Waking up in the crashed car felt like I had woken from one nightmare and entered another. Oh, what? I couldn't Whoa. remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. All right, chap one. All right, y'all, so we're gonna start here right now. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna do... Among Alice's things was a book. The Creator's Dilemma, by a Dr. Emil Hartman. Seeing the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like it, and I didn't like the guy's smug face on the cover either. 
All right, guys. So we're gonna start here right now. Uh, I am so curious about the story. All right, it, it's like I feel like when he get mad, his power get unleashed. Uh, whatever he writes, it come back to life. Something like that. I don't know. But like I said before, I'm gonna do a live stream for this. Uh, actually, I might start Wednesday morning at eight thirty in the morning Eastern time, and uh, I think. Tomorrow, we're going to have the final Dead Space remake. So, hey, until next time, like it, subscribe it, hit the notification button, and y'all have a blessed day.